This video is for Taurus, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Please make sure to check out your Sun, your Moon, and your Rising sign video as you may be operating more fully from that aspect of your personality at any given time. Also keep in mind, though I say this is you, we are all aware now that this can be you, your partner, or someone around you. Though I say it's you for simplicity. So the first card out is express your love. Go ahead and make that romantic gesture. Is there somebody that you have your eye on, but you're feeling a little bit timid around it saying, go ahead, go ahead, tell them. It doesn't mean that you have to go up and be like, hey, baby, but go talk to them at least, right? Go talk to them. Um, it says you deserve love and you are lovable. So this makes me wonder, are you having self-worth issues? That's what's holding you back from receiving the love that you need in your life. Maybe that could be the case. And then it's safe for you to love. Okay. So maybe you've been through a very toxic love relationship or you felt like you were used or abandoned in some way. And so you have difficulties with trust. Um, Maybe because you don't trust that they value you is kind of the feeling that I get. But you think they don't value you because you don't value you. Or at least not fully enough. Let's just put it that way, okay? Um, now, if that's not the case for you, like maybe you do have all this great self-value or whatever. But maybe you don't feel like you are equipped to be that person, but you are, you are, okay? I don't know, this could go so many different ways. Take it as you will, take it with a grain of salt. It's just cards. Um, but also I'm gonna put a little red flag out here. Somebody, it says reconciliation. Someone from your past is returning to your life. Now, before you go, oh, no, 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 no. Couple of things, person could have changed. I doubt it, but they could have. Otherwise, it also could be somebody that you didn't really have a romantic affiliation with, but you knew them in the past, okay? So don't get discouraged and be like, oh, no, I hate all of my exes. I don't want any of them to come back. It may not be an ex. It's just somebody from your past. It could be an ex. I'm not saying they're not. Um, yeah. So maybe, you know, this could even be somebody that you knew in the past, but you were kind of afraid to speak up. You didn't feel safe to tell the person how you felt or they didn't feel safe to tell you how that, wait, you or they didn't feel safe telling the other how they felt, okay? It could be a situation like that where you, you know, have an opportunity. It doesn't mean you have to get together, but it's an opportunity, okay? And this person may be somebody that was worth waiting for. Maybe they had to go through some trials and errors to see, you know, through to the other side, what was true and what was false, for instance, or um, maybe they were going through, you know, they were already married and got divorced, or there could be so many different reasons why this would happen. Some of you may even get engaged if you're not already married. Now, for others of you, like say you're already in a relationship, maybe you have difficulties expressing your love because you don't feel valued. That's another thing that I get for some of you. And it's saying, you know, how do I put this? Express your love, recognize that you do deserve love, and it's safe for you to love, but you need to speak up about how you feel so that you can reconcile it in your mind, whether you want to stay or you want to go instead of leaving it in limbo. That's for others of you, okay? And when you do this, don't go accusatory. You don't do this, you don't do that. It basically says with love, say, you know, pretty much like, I'm not saying you're guilty of this. I'm saying this makes me feel this way. You know, can you help me to understand this? Or, you know, maybe make a few adjustments because it would help me feel more secure. I mean, it could be just as simple as that. All right. So please make sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you again soon. Bye, guys.